Introduction to Intelligence Analysis Introduction This module will teach you the differences between information, intelligence and analysis. It also looks at how they are utilized, and how intelligence analysis was first used more than a millennium ago, and how it has changed since then. Topics to be covered in this module are the differences between information, intelligence, and analysis, the origins of intelligence analysis, the basic tasking model, the limits of the basic tasking model, how technology changed the model, knock-on effect due to technological changes, the analyst and developed tasking model, functions of the analyst, the problems of modern intelligence analysis. What are the differences between information, intelligence, and analysis? To begin gripping these terms, let's break them down. Information. This is raw data and can be of any type. Intelligence. In its simplest form this is information that has been evaluated. Analysis. The act of resolving or separating information or intelligence into their component parts. Understanding the difference between these terms and how they relate to one another is important. We can already see that these definitions point to key differences. Information is raw data, while intelligence is data that has been evaluated. The critical evaluation of the information is the key process that converts information into intelligence. It can be understood with the following equation. Information plus evaluation equals intelligence. Law enforcement, for example, is an organization that is tasked with gathering intelligence by the process of evaluating information in order to launch investigations. This would be an example of intelligence being used as a term to describe a department or group that gathers or deals with information. Intelligence involves some interpretation, which means there is speculation and risk involved. The quality and quantity of the information will have a direct impact on the amount of speculation and risk that goes into the interpretation.